Hi guys and welcome to TechBase. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 update for the main release, which is the build of 22,061.2215 or KB5029351. This is the C release for the month of August. And in this update, of course, there are a few new features that are currently optional and they will come as an official update on the B release for the month of September. And in this video, we're going to try to cover it all and see what has changed in this latest update for the main release. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, this update adds a new hover behavior to the search box claim. When you hover over it, the search file box might appear and you can adjust this behavior by right clicking on the taskbar and then going to taskbar behaviors. And here you'll be able to personalize your search experience. This update adjusts an issue that affects the search box. When you select it, the search box does not open. This occurs after a machine has been asleep. And also this update improves the reliability of the search app. This update addresses an issue that affects the tab key. Using it to browse search results requires additional actions. And this update also adds the new functionalities that allow you to pin apps and app defaults in Windows 11. I think that is pretty useful. And also an issue that causes high CPU use was fixed. This occurs when you enable the fblock non-domain policy. And also an issue that affects disk partitions was fixed. The system might stop working. This occurs after after you delete a disk partition and add the space from the deleted partition to an existing BitLocker partition. Regarding the start menu, this update addresses an issue that affects start menu icons. They are missing after you sign in for the first time. Related to settings, an issue that affects this app was fixed. Basically, the settings do not sync when you turn on the toggle in the Windows backup page in the settings app. And basically, these are mainly the highlights of this update for the main release. Of course, to get this latest update, make sure to go into the settings app, then go into the Windows update section, then click on check for updates. And we are also getting the Windows 11 service in stack 22,061.2061, which will basically ensure that you can receive and install Windows updates with no issues. So basically, this is the C release for the month of August. I'm hoping you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. For more information about this build, you can check out the article below in the video's description. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.